You see, over the past three months, teachers around the country have been protesting for decent pay and better classroom conditions. With strikes and marches in West Virginia, Oklahoma, Kentucky, Colorado, and one of the biggest ones happening right now in Arizona. Arizona is facing a fifth day of teacher walkouts and school closures today. The strike is impacting nearly two-thirds of the state's public schools and nearly 800,000 students. High school teacher Courtney Thompson says she works four jobs just to make ends meet and struggles at school. We have cockroaches in our school. We have rats in our school. It is crowded. Uh, hell yeah, it's crowded. You're also teaching rats and cockroaches. <laughs> and don't you dare call them pests. Because with the help of a passionate drama teacher, those rats and roaches will put on an absolutely stunning production of Spring Awakening. <laughs> but America really needs good teachers. Because without good teachers, you get college dropouts who say things like this. Now, Kanye West is defending himself against, really, the indefensible. He said slavery was a choice. Here's the same. You hear about slavery for 400 years? For 400 years? That sounds like a choice. <laughs> <laughs> just, just me? <laughs> no, Kanye. Slavery is not a choice. Going blonde is a choice. <laughs> Both are terrible, but one is easier to undo. Although, actually, you know what? When I think about it, slavery was a choice for white people. Yeah. White people were like, Hey, should we keep doing stuff ourselves or make other people do it for us? Hmm. Yeah, other people. Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good. <laughs> good choice. So, uh, Kanye West popped up at TMZ's offices and decided to freestyle some history lessons. Uh, thankfully, TMZ staffer Van Lathan was there to call Kanye out in person. Producer Van Lathan like taking that. West to task about Kanye. the slavery comment. While you are making music and being an artist, the rest of us in society have to deal with these threats to our lives. Frankly, I'm disappointed, I'm appalled, and brother, I am unbelievably hurt by the fact that you have morphed into something, to me, that's not real. Wow, that was powerful. That was really, really powerful. And you know there was one scared white person in that office who was like, hello, police. <laughs> There's two black people arguing in the office right now. <laughs> you know, normally, I, I wouldn't really care what Kanye West said about slavery or black history, but what does suck is that now every member of the Tiki Torch Club out there is gonna use Kanye's words to justify their hate. You know, basically, the way Kanye samples old-school soul music is how racists are gonna sample him now. And it'll be like, well, black folks have choices like slavery. <laughs> so look, Kanye may think he's just being a free thinker, but the truth is there's nothing good coming out of this. Except maybe, maybe, an idea for a new movie. And that servant that don't obey his Lord shall be beaten with many stripes. Oh, shit! Love my job. In my life, in my life. Hey, y'all ready to pick some cotton? I got donuts. I see the light. Being a slave is the best choice I ever made. I get to work and have fun in the sun. Master bought you here to work, that's all. Anymore, I'll earn you a hundred lashes. Well, I might need to talk to HR about that. Do what you love, you never work a day in your life. Get back to work, boy. Shit. <laughs>